individual agreement with Egregor. Is it possible? If I see the realization of my potential in teaching and scientific work, but I believe that compensation is insufficient, is it necessary to make an individual agreement with the Egregor? As for wages, they don't have to be in the form of money. I agree to other benefits, such as connections, opportunities, and luck. Yes, of course, Elena. Let's see. The better you're as a specialist, the more valuable you are to the Egregor. Any agreement you make with the Egregor of your work, is always made on someone's terms. I would recommend that you, considering all the current changes, not only look at the Egregor of your firm where you are exchanging your time and skill for money, but also look at the system of your professional egregor, because a professional egregor can possess a numerous amount of such firms while lacking true professionals. Therefore, if your professional egregor looks at you not as a common laborer, but rather as a true potential of consciousness capable of letting the information through and transforming it into scientific conclusions, then your value to the system and to your professional egregor becomes much higher. And of course, this is different level of agreement regardless of the firm you are currently working at. Completely different. Because the firm serves a professional egregor, therefore, I suggest you do it with your firm. If you make an agreement with your professional egregor, then you no longer need to make any agreements with your firm. You will be able to just give it an order and your firm will be obligated to obey. Now, when it comes to establishing a contact with an egregor, and the actual mechanism of the process. Here the agreement takes place in the form of dialogue, and you must understand that it isn't human, although you will have to decipher its messages through your own mind. In order to connect to the egregoral system, you will need to become included into it. The inclusion traditionally occurs through a symbol. Every profession, every enterprise, every major structure has a specific symbol. The symbol makes it possible for you not only to enter the egregor, but also to evoke it because to enter the egregor, one should know specific codes which, as a rule, are never kept in public view. So call upon it through the symbol, that is, on your inner screen, in the area of the third eye, in the area of entry into the buddhic body, you form this symbol, vividly and imaginatively, and by establishing contact with it, you initiate a dialogue. You make your demands, it makes demands of its own. If we are talking about lower order egregores, those at the level of elemental forces, at the level of kin and family, for instance, a family enterprise, their abilities are typically limited and they may not always be able to do what you need. That is, they will surely consume your time and reimburse you according to the rules present at this level. It's a different story if you connect with a professional egregore. Its capabilities are completely different. There you can interact not only at the level of money, but also at the level of professional information, luck, and maybe some other elements of power, and perhaps, some other additional preferences related to science, teaching, that is, anything relevant to your profession. But you also, after connecting to this system, will not remain the same. Remember that your professionalism must grow. This is the only way you will be able to prove that there is a reason why you call yourself the best, you are a warrior and responsible for your words, you are truly a professional as you have identified yourself, and it is not a lie, a figure of speech, or illusion you suffer from. This means that you are required to possess additional skills, an additional level of professionalism, additional training in all those areas in which you claim to be entitled to receive from or give to. I hope, colleague, I have explained it clearly and helped you with my advice.